All right. Uh, it's recording right now. I only see 17 people on still, so we're going to have to wait a little bit longer. Um, we should be starting right now, but I don't think we have enough people yet. All right, let me just adjust a couple of things here. All right, it's, I should see everyone now. I made it so it's the maximum amount of tiles. All right, so I do have a piece of paper and I do have a pencil. Uh, for me though, I think I'm gonna be doing it in Sharpie instead, just so it's easier to see on camera. All right, it's uh, 11.16. Um, so I am going to have to start just in case if I do run out of time at the very end. So here we go. All right. So first step, what we're going to do is let's talk about what we're doing so you guys aren't uh, aren't clueless. Uh, what I want to do today is draw a husky, and the husky is celebrating that it's the year 2021. So basically, he's at a New Year's party. So first step I want to draw is the top hat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a nice horizontal line to resemble the brim of the hat. I'm going to go up a little bit and draw another horizontal line so it's nice and thick. And let me just move my paper a little bit lower because I want to make this top hat nice and tall, just like so. Go back. Miss the roll. Back down. Uh, Abik, what's up? Hello. Um, I didn't get my paper. Can you go give me time to go get it? You'll catch up. Don't worry. Uh, go get it. Go ahead. All right. Um, we can uh, catch up really easily. Miss All right. So, no. uh, yeah. What's up? This is how I draw my top hats when I when I'm doing something like this. Uh, you showing me something? No, I mean, I draw my top hats like this when I um when I draw some like pictures. <laughs> Okay, um, so let's get started again. Uh, for the top hat, I do want to put the year at the very bottom so you can see it. Um, you can either write the year normally, like how I'm doing right now. So here's my two, a zero, another two, and a one. Or if you want to make it more three-dimensional, you can go and make it blocky. So here is the two in a block form. Here's a zero in a block form, and then making the two more three-dimensional also, and then the one more three-dimensional as well. If you do have extra room on the left or right hand side, you can add either like an exclamation point or a husky paw or a star. And then I'm going to add a horizontal line on top to close it off, just like so. Now, I wouldn't worry about coloring it right now, uh, but I'm just going to shade it in because I have time. And while I'm doing this, hopefully those who are falling behind, uh, they can catch up as I'm coloring. So don't color yet. Um, I'm just coloring so it gives the people that are falling behind uh, a little more time to catch up. So this is their time to catch up right now. All right. Awesome. All right, so let's do the nose of the husky. The nose of the husky is going to be an upside down triangle. And I'm going to go from the top hat, go a little bit lower, make sure I have enough room for the eyes. Eyes are going to go right there. So I'm going to put the nose right over here. So this is going to be an upside down triangle with optional nostrils. You don't have to do nostrils if you don't want. I'm just going to do our nostrils on each side of those triangles. There you go. Billy, you have a question? Oh, accident. Can I do mine differently than yours? Yeah, yeah. It's your drawing. You can do whatever you want. All right. Again, as I'm waiting, I'm going to color mine in just because I want to make sure people have enough time to catch up. I'm making mine brown. All right. So in order to make the nose uh, protrude out more, unlike how humans have, uh, I am going to create a little bit of a bump on the very top end by creating a little bit of a curve. So one end here and curve right about there. OK. And using that line, it could be the bottom half of the eyes. So you could do any eyes you want. You could do beady eyes. Cute eyes. I'm gonna do eyes like this. I'm gonna go from the curve, going around. I don't around. have a paper. You can use whiteboard if you want, or you can just watch. I don't have a whiteboard either. Oh, just watch for right now, Anthony. 
that's fine just watching this as long as you're here that's all that matters all right and again uh you can do any eyes you want i think i might want to make my eyes pupils black so let me just uh, make a nice black oval or circle in the middle color it in i'm coloring it in because i'm giving more time for people that need to catch up i think i might make the outside of his eyes green there you go there we are nice all right next part i do want to create the mouth so in order to do the mouth i'm just going to create a nice vertical line at the end of the nose right about that big right there and then i want to do a sideways three to make him look like he's smiling so i'm gonna go from here go around here and around and since it is a husky i do want to add little baby teeth on each end if you do want to add a tongue sticking out you're allowed to it's up to you to decide if you want that or not um i don't want to add whiskers because i'm afraid that it might make it look like a cat so i will not all right let's start off with the ears next now the ears are going to be overlapping uh, behind the hat a little bit. So go from behind the hat, so right around here. Kind of make a diagonal line going outwards. And then kind of come back. There you go. And then do the exact same thing on the other side. There we are. And notice how it's like kind of behind the top hat. So when you add the inside triangles, you might have to go behind the brim of the hat. Just like so. And again, I will color to save people time uh, if they're falling behind. So if they're falling behind, uh, now would be the time to catch up because I'm busy coloring. So now would be the best time to try and catch up with us. I'm going to add a little bit of yellow on the border of this hat here. There we go. Awesome. All right. Next step, I do want to do the side of the face. So on each side of the ears, let's go down a little bit, or about that much probably, that much. Okay. And then this part might be difficult for some people, but I'm going to add uh, about three zigzags on each side. So one, two, three. And then on this side, one, two, three. That part might be difficult for some people, but it's okay if you can't do it. And then on the chin, I'm just going to create a nice curve right on the bottom to resemble the chin right there. There we are. If you want to connect it, you can. Connect, connect. There we are. Awesome possum. Oh, good job, Ivy. Nice job. Let's see what time it is. Oh, 11.24. We have about six minutes left. I think six minutes is a perfect amount of time. And again, um, if you are falling behind, this is being recorded. So you can, you can always rewatch it later. All right, I'm gonna go keep going just in case if I run out of time here. I'm gonna add a bow tie. It's optional, you don't have to if you don't want to. I'm gonna add a bow tie right around here. And then for the front feet, so I think now's the time I can probably lower my drawing station a little bit. I'm gonna just move this like this. There we go. That's a little bit lower. All right, let's add the feet first. So here I'm going to go on this side of the, feet, of the face, go down and towards the body. So inwards, loop around. So that's one foot. And the exact same thing on the opposite side. So I'm going to loop around like that. It might look odd right now, but it'll make more sense once we're done. I'm going to add two. Uh, little lines on each foot so one two three four to resemble the toes
Once that's done, on top of these feet, let's draw a nice vertical line going up about this much on each end. If you do plan on coloring this later, uh, this line will make more sense, but I'm going to connect these two feet together with a horizontal line. It's about that small. But that line might not make sense right now, but it'll make more sense once you're coloring. If you decide to color it. All right, let's do the back hind legs. Back hind legs are pretty simple. Just go out and curve up. Out, then curve back up. And then for the toes, just kind of create two vertical lines. You can curve them if you like, just like so. And then since his back legs are bent, you want to go up at an angle. So right around here like this, up, then curve back towards the body. So up and curve back towards the body. All right, he's almost done. If you want to do a tail, you can. I like to put it off to the side because I like to pretend that it's off to the side like this. Or if you just don't want to add a tail because you want to pretend that it's not in view, that's allowed too. All right, and that's how you do a New Year's theme husky. There we go, and we're all done. I think we have a couple minutes to spare. So in a couple seconds, we can share it with the camera and everyone else if you'd like. What's this, Mel? Abik, what's up? Look at this. Whoa. That's awesome. And look, I thought you were worried about catching up, but you were the color too. Awesome. Awesome job. Um, I'm going to add a couple more details here. You don't have to if you don't want to. But you see these vertical lines that we added for the feet? Um, some people like to add a little bit of a zigzag going downwards like this to resemble like the front half of the body. But that's optional. You don't have to. Um, so like when you're coloring, you can kind of like make the, the stomach a different color than the feet. Uh, some people like to add zigzags right where the feet are too. Just in case you want to make the feet like white and then the body uh, gray or something. So if I cut, actually, no, let me just add another zigzag in between the tail. Because if I'm coloring this, it can probably make more sense. Hold on. Why don't I color my husky? Let's see. What color do I have? I'll use crayon. I'm going to make my husky blue because I want to make it blue. But if I color it, you can see that if I keep my feet white it, and my stomach white, it looks a little more different. So it's pretty cool. There. And then the top of the tail, blue, and then the back of the, the bottom of the tail, white. They're pretty neat. I don't know how to do the face, though. I'm really confused about the face. You can make the ears blue or colored, I should say. And I think I should make the side of the face blue. There you go. I think that makes sense, right? Maybe like a little bit of the center piece right here, maybe. Right there. I don't know. I think I did the best I could. All right, there we are. Pretty cool. All right, with that said, if you want to share your picture with everyone, you can hold up to the camera just like how Abik did. Awesome. Adriana, good job. Adrian, awesome job. Isabel, cool job. All right. The time now is 11.29. If you want to keep sharing it, you can. Otherwise, you are allowed to head out. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Happy New Bye. Year. Bye. Happy New Year. Bye. Mr. Happy New Year. Bye. Mr. Mill, look at mine. Bye. Good job. Bye. Bye. I like your friendly. Very nice. I put a sweater on mine. I do. And thank you very much for my Christmas present. You're welcome. Bye. Oh, you're I appreciate it. Okay. Bye. Okay.